journalist Megyn Kelly criticized former First Lady and failed Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton for her recent New York Times column and new book. During a recent episode of her podcast, The Megyn Kelly Show, the host, alongside Maureen Callahan of Daily Mail, touch on the cover of Clinton's upcoming book, Something Lost, Something Gained. The amount of free touching on this face, Kelly said. I haven't seen since Joan Rivers had her 15th surgery. God love Joan. I don't know what she's trying to be with this soft focus. The columnist told the host, the retoucher deserves a huge raise. This is a much more soft, welcoming, friendly, I suppose. Although again, self-awareness, something lost. I wonder what that was. The woman who wrote a book called What Happened? Like marveling over all the external forces that could have caused her loss in a presidential election that was handed to her on a silver platter. The two commentators also discuss Clinton's op-ed in the New York Times regarding what it's like to be on the other side of a debate with former President Donald Trump. Clinton said any attempt to refute his remarks would be a waste of time as he starts with nonsense and then digresses into blather. Kelly joked, why aren't you the president if you're so smart about how to debate Trump? Asking for a friend. It didn't work out for you, the host said, directing her words to Clinton herself. But she comes in like the elder stateswoman, like you can do it perfectly is really what she's arguing. And it won't help because you can't debate this insane man. These are just insults. Actually, what he, Trump, did was he got out there and said you'd be in jail if you were in charge, and people love the challenge of power of somebody who'd been considered untouchable, Kelly continued. You in the meantime, as we now know, were cheating behind the scenes of these debates. He was not cheating with the Russians or anyone else. And he was raising issues that really matter to working class and middle America, whom she totally ignored. None of that is in the op-ed, she noted. As OK previously reported, Kelly also recently ridiculed Clinton for going on a late-night talk show tour to encourage people to vote for President Joe Biden. Get over yourself. You don't matter. Do what's right for the global citizenry, which is clearly to elect the compassionate one with the heart, Kelly said, mocking the alleged tone of Clinton's remarks on The Tonight Show.